Ahead of the budget session, the Kurdish delegation re-enters discussion arena. It is hoped that the Kurdish delegation negotiating this evening tomorrow will resume its session to discuss its share in the federal budget for 21. In important news, you can find it on Alpharet News Channel on the Telegram to subscribe, click here. A representative source revealed to the Euphrates News a delegation from the Kurdistan delegation will arrive this evening, Saturday, to the capital Baghdad to discuss the terms of the budget before the meeting to pass the budget tomorrow, Sunday. On Friday, House of Representatives announced the postponement of its session for approving the budget until tomorrow, Sunday. The media department stated that given the continuing discussions on the draft budget law and the need for final formulations of the articles of the budget bill, the presidency of the council decided that the voting session on the draft budget law would take place tomorrow, Sunday. So they're saying right now they want to do the budget on Sunday. Herbal announces a political agreement with Baghdad regarding oil. Kurdistan Union announced on Friday they have a political agreement on oil. Re and let's see if that will enable them to complete the budget on Sunday. Kurdish delegation in Baghdad today optimism that the budget will be approved tomorrow Sunday. Delegation from Kurdistan tomorrow Sunday in Baghdad will resume its negotiations regarding the share of the Kurdistan region in the federal budget in a positive atmosphere by resolving the controversial points and voting on the budget. The deputy from the Kurdistan Democratic Bloc told Shafik News, Kurdistan delegation will arrive this evening and tomorrow will hold a meeting to resolve the points of contention to reach a final agreement vote on the budget law. al Haddad announces the results of the meeting of the Finance Committee with the government on the budget. Deputy Speaker of Parliament al Haddad announced the results of the Parliamentary Finance Committee meeting with a number of ministers regarding the federal budget law stressing the need to address the rise in food and commodity prices. al Haddad said in a statement that presiding over a joint meeting at the hotel in central Baghdad between parliamentary finance and the ministers of oil, housing, labor, social affairs, and the chairman of the federal service that a detailed discussion and discussion of the articles, articles draft budget law for 21 included the agenda of tomorrow's session. He added points that the budget for the service ministries, the disbursement doors for service projects in case the budget is approved. Importance of approving the budget because its effects of the general situation is linked to work of the ministry service projects and provision of job opportunities for young people. He pointed out the need to address high prices for foodstuffs, commodities, and the solutions and alternatives to the repercussions for the exchange rate of the Iraq dinar. KRG delegation approved the proposal of the parliamentary blocks regarding the Kurdistan's budget share. Deputy Speaker Iraqi Parliament announced on Saturday that the Kurdistan Regional Government Delegation approved the Parliamentary Bloc's proposal approved the Finance Committee regarding the share of the budget. He added that in a press statement, a press conference, held after the meeting of the Finance Committee with the government team of ministries, that the exchange rate was discussed and it was emphasized that the budget for this year should not be in debt, adding that the government... And most of the members of the finance committee, while keeping the exchange rate in its current position to help to hold a meeting with the governor of the central bank and joint committee, will be formed. Will form the government and parliament to discuss how to maintain, without affecting market conditions, that the exchange is not within the budget. He added, indicating that the presidency of the council of representatives will hold a meeting with the parliamentary blocks prior to the session to reach an agreement to pass the budget, expressing that it is hoped that a vote on the draft law will take place in tomorrow's session. Sunday, regarding the Kurdistan region's share of the budget, he added who is a member of the Kurdistan Democratic Bloc, the, the article regarding the region's share in the draft budget law was not the reason and the problem is not voting on the budget. He continued by saying that the Kurdistan regional government delegation agreed to the text that was agreed upon with the political blocks regarding the region's share. He added emphasized that the Parliament's Finance Committee approved this agreement and it has become an established article in the budget and cannot be tampered with or withdrawn in any because of the 
because it has become a law article, stressing that the regional government delegation and the Kurdish representatives in parliament are dealing with this text approved and signed by the committee will not be content to withdraw from this agreement. And he went on to say that there are parties seeking to block the passage of the bill and that Iraq should remain without a budget this year. I'm going to repeat that last sentence one more time. And he went on to say that there are parties seeking to block the passage of the bill and Iraq should remain without a budget this year. Hope you guys heard that carefully. Okay, we've got a little more news here for you. All right. An economist for Tigris, the government does not have tools to reduce inflation except through the exchange rate. So this article is telling you, I've already shown you guys factually that the devaluation has hiked their inflation. The only way to bring it down to reduce the inflation would be to uh, put the exchange rate back to where it was at 1190. The price of the dollar and foreign currencies against the dinar, that's just giving you the market value of the dinar, not, a, not an important article. A parliament denies the parliamentary finance agreement and the government regarding the exchange rate of the dollar. This article is just telling you that parliament, de- they're denying the parliamentary finance agreement and the government regarding the exchange rate. So you guys already know that both parliament, parliament is contesting where it's at. Parliament wants to put it back to 1190. The CBI says, eh, nope, sorry, it's going to stay where it's at. So there's just two points of contention. The price of the dollar in the region's share learn about the results of the ministerial meeting of the budget. The, well, we'll look at this article for you guys. Okay. So on this article, price of the dollar in the region's share learn about the results of the ministerial meeting on the budget. Deputy Speaker of Parliament added the on Saturday, the results of the parliamentary ministerial meeting was held at Al Rashid Hotel to discuss the current year's budget. Al Haddad said in a press conference that during the meeting, a detailed discussion and discussion of the articles, articles of the draft law budget for 21, were included in the agenda for tomorrow's session. We're also studied budget budgets for service ministries and the disbursement sections for service projects in the event the budget is approved he pointed to the importance of approving the budget because its effects on the general situation for the young people needed to address high prices so guys are simply saying it's important to get the budget approved correct the exchange rate so it doesn't have such a drastic impact on the citizens okay so that's kind of, we already kind of went through that article anyway in the previous news. State of law rejects the current exchange rate and invites the finance committee. So we already know that, guys, through the week, the state of law has already said that they're really upset with what the CBI has done and they want the rate put back to where it was so it doesn't hinder and impact the lives of the citizens. A parliamentary bloc refuses to vote on the budget because of the exchange rate. That's That's the... We already know that, guys. They've announced to us through the week that some of the political blocks were refusing to vote on the budget simply because the exchange rate is too high. They want to again. They want to have it back, put back to 1190 to improve the lives of the citizens. So, as you guys see, Iraq is now saying that that they may approve the budget tomorrow. You decide. Take care, folks. Have a great day.